My name is Keith Hardiman, and I'm a streetwise vendor. And as I tell everyone else, any day above the ground is a good day. Streetwise is an organization that empowers people to work. We do that through a number of ways. The way we're most well known for is the magazine. We produce a magazine each week, sell it to the vendors for 90 cents, and they in turn go out and sell it for $2. Through all of the programs, we help provide for basic needs. So food, clothing, hygiene supplies, and then certainly a communal space where people can, can engage. Right now with this coronavirus and everything, it's put a damper in the business, man. It's like a, a ghost town. Only thing we missing out here is the tumbleweed. With everything going on with the coronavirus, Streetwise is continuing to stay open. We're operating a very skeleton operations. We have vendors who are still coming in and purchasing the magazines and trying to sell them out on the corner, which is becoming increasingly difficult with people telecommuting and social distancing. For some of our vendors who are immunocompromised, it's not great for them to be out there, but the reality is that they have bills that they have to pay, and for many, Streetwise is their sole source of income. Well, I got to survive. I, I need a roof over my head. I need to eat, wash my clothes. I live at a hotel uh, over on Pulaski. I pay $35 a day. Uh, for the last two and a half months, that's where I've been. And as long as I'm, I'm going to keep a roof over my head, got to. You know, unfortunately for many of our vendors, this is legitimately the delta, the gap between life and death. Um, many of our vendors are immunosuppressed or in some way immunocompromised. So if they get thrown out of their hotel room, apartment, single room occupancy and head into the shelters, uh, which can be, you know, germ infested and contagions can spread quickly when you're sleeping with four and 500 other people, you know, those those facilities are doing their best, too, and we're obviously wishing the best and supporting those facilities as well. But we want to keep our vendors in their own apartments. We launched a campaign really for the viability of our vendors. It's almost like a vendor emergency fund. We need to raise three hundred thousand dollars here very quickly. Yesterday, we launched the campaign and raised fifty thousand dollars. So we still have a ways to go. But the initial overwhelming just generosity and support from the community has been tremendous. Streetwise is a great organization, especially if you're out there and you done fell through the cracks and you may be homeless or you're on drugs or you're unemployable. Whatever your condition may be, you can come to Streetwise and get you a head start. We'll start you out with 15 free papers. You come to orientation. Okay, we'll give you a location. We'll give you a badge. It's not over with, okay? It's just slow right now. It's a good way to uh, get people off the street and get them on their feet. We're here to help. If you want to help yourself, come by Streetwise. We'll to make a way out of no way. Self-improvement, self-employment. I need your help. Streetwise needs your help. And don't be afraid. All right? You have a great day and happy Thursday. Hey, if you like that video, be sure to subscribe to our ABC7 Chicago YouTube channel.